we call in the old days thick skin. You know, and uh, you can have a bodybuilder at that level that uh, is, seems to be in good condition uh, with good separations, but not really showing a lot of the muscular definition and detail that's necessary to get that winning spot. And and that's usually the tough formula, boy, that thin skin, finish, polish look um, that we came to uh, always be able to know that when you stepped on stage, you were going to have. <laughs> I had no choice. G giving away a 40 or 50 pound advantage to those bigger guys, if, uh, if I wasn't spot on, I was toast. Face front. There's two shots. Well, we always love it when the... Uh, Pro bodybuilders around the world who can't make the trip, uh, tune into our webcast, and uh, we always appreciate when you guys check in, and we actually just got some notes coming in. Our good friend, IA50 Pro King Kamali, is actually watching the webcast, so let's give a big shout out to King, and he actually sent along of his thoughts. He actually has uh, Branch winning the contest, Evan Santapani finishing in the number two spot based on what he's seen so far, and King also adds that if Victor were just a few percentage points better, Victor Martinez would be the yeah, champion. What do you think about that, Jeff? Uh, I couldn't agree more. I'll tell you what. I mean, I think Victor is much.